under a red flag situation here at the NASCAR Sprint Cup Series event at Pocono. It's presented by Aaron's 35 laps remaining. And it all started with uh, Jimmy Johnson trying to bump draft and it just went wrong. Well, it's just, yeah, he's trying to get a little bit of a push. They've been battling here, the Clint Boyer and the two Kirk Bush. You can see he just gets in, but they're so close. You know, the 33 was down trying to side draft the two a little bit. And then as Kirk Bush comes back across, he gets hit again. Pieces start flying off. And as bad as this is, we thought this was the worst. And there's another hard hit, but not bad. We saw Kirk get out and walk away, but a lot worse was happening even behind this with Elliot Sadler. Mike uh, Massaro has caught up with Kurt. Let's talk and, to him. And Kurt has just walked out of the care center. First off, how are you? I feel pretty good. What happened? Got wrecked on the straightaway. How did it happen? Jimmy Johnson drove straight through us. Okay. Thank you, Kurt. Obviously, Kurt very upset with the situation and uh, pretty quick assertion of what happened. Well, and you heard uh, Jimmy, I think, a little earlier on the radio saying, I think I started all that, and he was trying to bump draft. and. Obviously, uh, Kurt doesn't want to hear that right now. No, it was an intentional situation, certainly. It's hard racing, and, you know, the bad thing, Kurt and Jimmy have had their issues before, and so, you know, Kurt's going to look at it in, in that situation. I'm not saying he's wrong for doing that, but... Uh, no, it, coming from his seat, I mean, he, no, he, he just got crashed from behind. Yes, exactly, and on the straightaway, as he said. All right, let's go back and show you one more time, and then we'll listen in on the radio, and... Here is the sequence as Jimmy was trying to bump draft and it just got ugly from this moment. As Kurt hits the wall, then comes down and gets collected again by the 33 of Boyer. Man, that was kind of my fault. Tell those guys I'm sorry, I was trying to bump draft him like you wanted me to. Step four. And then Elliot Sadler, uh, this is the only angle we really have of this, folks. Just watch on the right side of your screen. It will come into play here. And it is a wicked hit. Now, this is ugly right here. You see it comes just at the worst place you could hit at this track. Man. So much force that the motor was ripped off the mounts. The whole front portion of the car literally destroyed. And cleanup continue the cleanup. We have just been informed that uh, the 19 of Elliot Sadler. He, good news here, folks. He is going to be released from the medical center here momentarily. Uh, Mike Massaro is standing by, and we'll hopefully be able to talk to him. But man, look at that no race fixing car. That car. That's one going in the trash can right there. Man. All right. We're going to take another break while we have the opportunity. And uh, as we said, we're waiting for Elliot to uh, be released from the infield care center. As soon as we can, we'll talk to him and bring it to you here at Pocono.